Hey there, you filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back with another episode of the GTM Show. Turns out my surgery is going to be on May 20th, so I find myself with a few days to burn before they actually cut me open and put me back together again so I can be normal. And uh, what better way to spend my time than to eat a few things that I shouldn't be eating? One is spicy, the other one is corn products. And here we go. We got the Doritos Roulette. As seen in Canada, this is the package you're looking for. If you're looking for it in stores, this is now a U.S. item. After being in Canada, it popped up at a few other places around the world. Finally, here in the U.S., here we have it. So, the dealio with this is it's just regular nacho cheese flavored Doritos, but mixed into the bag are some of the, the hot Doritos, the spicy ones. A few years ago, we saw them bring out like uh, three different levels of heat flavored ones, and they tried to incorporate some cross advertising with Pepsi to cool your mouth off from the burn with the Pepsi. We do have our Pepsi on standby. We have our bag of Doritos Roulette. Let's bust this open, see what we got going on. Let's see the level of heat that they've gone with on this. Dip right into this here. I just busted out four of them, and uh, yeah, they just they really look the same. You know, Yeah, they smell like uh, nacho cheese Doritos. So, here we go. Let's try this one out. Let's see what we got. Right off the bat, first one. That one's got some burn to it. I don't even have to get into this. It came off just like a nacho cheese flavored Dorito, but after about 5-10 seconds in, you start to get a little tingle going on. Then the heat steps in. So right now I have a, a nice level of heat actually going across my tongue into the back of my throat. You got a nice little heat, a little burn. And that's about it. Roof of my mouth, fine. Under my tongue, fine. But yeah. It's mostly a uh, tongue and back of the throat burn going on here. And that is pretty goddamn spicy for a chip. And after munching down the rest of that chip there, it's about the same level of heat. It doesn't really build. So, yeah, I don't think this one's going to have you screaming for milk or ice cream. But, yeah, there is a nice level of heat, a little burn going on there. And I don't even have to go any further into the bag because we all know what nacho cheese flavored Doritos taste like already. So, uh, yeah. Definitely got my attention there on the very first chip. What I will say is it's not a building heat, but it's a lingering heat. As I've been talking here for a few minutes, it hasn't gone away, and it stayed the same. It's not uh, not descending at all in the level of heat that we have going on. And goddamn spicy chips right there for Doritos. Definitely a nice level of heat going on here with a nice nacho cheese flavor right up in the front. You don't get that in the aftertaste at all. You just have the, the heat burn going on. Not a bad product. Pretty fun. You know, it's a novelty. It is what it is. But, uh, yeah. Not bad. I'm going to give it a four. There you have it. The Doritos Roulette on the GTM show. Knock that out. Um, like I said, we have a few days to burn. So you will be seeing an episode this weekend of Porta Patty. You will see an episode of Bullshit. And then, um... I just go into operation prep after that. So you probably won't be seeing any more of the GTM show until I come out of recovery. Until then, if you had these already, let me know what you think. Leave me a message down in the comment section. You can also follow me on Twitter at the Real Mr. Dirty. Uh, even through all of this, you're still going to find me in the social networks, you know, still f***ing around with people on there. But, um, yeah, just not throwing out videos every day until after recovery. So if you're looking for me, just hit me up on the social media pages, uh, Twitter, Instagram, uh, some of you know how to find us on Facebook, Google+, the usual sh**. Alright, so until then, have a rotten day.